out of town the last two weeks and I just got back last night when I was driving through the town. Oh my God, it was so sad to see. So today I had to go into town and, um, I'm sorry, today I'm going into town and to get some groceries and while I'm in town, I'm gonna go ahead and video um, the aftermath of it. Apparently, it's only been a couple of days, but uh, we have a big, huge event coming up, a big, huge Jeep event, um, Jeep Safari for Labor Day weekend. So the town is really trying to get everything uh, cleaned up and everything So before this event. So looks like they've been doing pretty good too, at least uh, from the pictures that I've seen. Okay, so apparently yesterday morning, um, right when I was getting back in town, or uh, before I was getting back in town, sorry, um, Moab was covered in all these mud piles. And the mud piles is from all the mud that washed up into town. So they're doing pretty good about clearing up and cleaning the uh, town right now. Um, because I didn't see any of these on the main street. This was off of the main street. So that's a good sign.
So they have this whole entire street and this whole entire area shut down. As you guys can see, the uh, trees that all fell down over there. And it's like that all the way down. But they have it roped off, so can't really walk too far. Um, lots of streets are closed off right now due to them still getting the mud up and everything that uh and the debris so it's kind of crazy but yeah they have a lot of things like roped off with the caution tape and everything but they seem to be uh getting it cleaned up pretty quickly i mean oh right in front of me is actually a hotel and it looks like this hotel was pretty damaged too um looks like the flood went right into these rooms let me turn this around so you guys can see this yeah so that's the hotel over there you guys can see 